This Focus on Health segment is brought to you by Aurora Healthcare. Hello and welcome to Focus on Health. I'm Ted Stefaniak. Today we're at the Aurora Medical Center and we're going to be talking with Dr. Elon Shapiro, who is using computers to assist him with joint replacement. Thanks for joining us, Dr. Shapiro. Why don't we start out a little bit about talking about where you trained and a little bit about you. Well, I uh, grew up in Milwaukee. I trained at uh, University of Wisconsin Medical School, did my general surgery there, and then I went to New York City and did my training at Hospital for Joint Diseases, which is an orthopedic hospital. All right. And what, what about your experience? How long have you been doing this? I've been in practice roughly about 24 years. Okay. And we're talking about computer-assisted knee surgery. What exactly are we talking about here? Well, uh, people have the idea that a computer is doing the surgery. What computer-assisted means is we're using a computer to take extremely accurate measurements of, of the knee. And so at the very beginning of the procedure, we put pins in the bones, and the pins are connected to these arrays. There's three reflective balls on each side. And the computer can, by bouncing infrared rays off of here, can give us measurements that are accurate to within one to three millimeters and three degrees of accuracy. So it greatly improves our ability to do a good job, which in turn means hopefully your knee replacement will last longer and function better. Probably a little bit different than what people would generally think of when they think of knee replacement. Uh, the actual knee replacement itself is, is very similar to the routine knee replacement. It's just that our level of accuracy and doing the job right uh, is much higher. And it looks like with the computer assisted knee surgery, minimal incision? Uh, we can and the reason for that is during the surgery we use a probe like this that also has three reflective balls on it and what we do is during the surgery we are able to map this person's knee exactly and so we're generating a model of this knee and not just an average knee. Uh, this also allows us to get in through smaller incisions if we choose to do that. So it's, it's very helpful in that regard. Now something I wasn't aware of, there, there are different types of knee replacement. What type of knee replacement do you use? Uh, the type of knee replacement we use has a very long track record. Uh, it's a state-of-the-art device. Uh, it's been improved uh, incrementally over many years. But what it is, it, it looks very similar to a standard knee replacement that many companies make. But it has the addition that it can also rotate side to side. And that more accurately reproduces the motion of the natural knee where the knee actually externally rotates a little bit when you flex and extend the knee. And so what that means, hopefully, in the long run is you have less wear because the, the whole mechanism is, is reproducing the motions that, that are natural to the knee. And you talk about wear, so there is a, how long would you expect something like that to last? In, uh, in general, these have very good track record. Uh, in the average person, they last 15 to 25 years. And so they, uh, probably over 95% that have been put in in the last 15 years or so are still in. Now is there a benefit to having the computer assisted knee surgery compared to the regular knee surgery when it comes to recovery time? Uh, we believe there is. We're seeing patients getting their motion back faster, recovery times, uh, uh, commonly I'll see recovery times cut by a month from the typical three months down to about two months, but that's not everybody, but we are seeing a faster recovery and better motion as a result of being able to do the job more accurately. And I understand that one of the options, instead of a total knee replacement, would be a partial knee replacement. What's the benefit to a partial knee? A partial knee replacement uh, is a much faster recovery. And what we do is we just replace the part of the knee that's worn out. So if someone has just half of the knee that the arthritis is on, that's the side that we replace. And it's a much faster recovery, a more natural feeling knee. So, so why did you decide to, to get involved with computer assisted knee surgery? Uh, I got involved, uh, at first I was very skeptical, but then I got involved because uh, one of my partners had extensive experience in doing this and he convinced me that this was uh, something to try. 
Uh, the reason that a lot of places are not doing this is uh, the cost of the equipment is very prohibitive. Uh, and also, there's a, extra training involved in learning how to do it. And in the past, it would take an extra 10, 15 minutes uh, to do the procedure, which some surgeons feel uh, they don't want to devote to, to that operation. Uh, we now have the latest generation of software that dramatically reduces the setup time for taking all the measurements and mapping the knee out. So a lot of hospitals don't use this, but fortunately you guys do. The majority don't. Right. Yeah. Okay. Well, Dr. Shapiro, thanks for taking the time with us oh, today. Thank you. Now, if you'd like to know more information about computer-assisted joint replacement, the doctors here at Aurora offer free informational seminars. So all you have to do to check that out is go to the website, aurora.org backslash calendar, or call 303-8880 to schedule an appointment with Dr. Shapiro or any of the other doctors here in the orthopedic department. I'm Ted Stefaniak, and we'll see you next time on Focus on Health. This Focus on Health segment has been brought to you by Aurora Healthcare.